na na what's his name oh na na what's his name what's his name what's his name big up to everyone of course guys andre onana has officially signed for manchester united reported for almost close to 45 million pounds including add-ons as well but it is true it's finally done Manchester united and making it official by releasing a post as well and i will show you guys later on but make sure guys for those who are new to the channel before we even get kicked off in this video make sure you subscribe to red united tv on youtube as well and become a member of the red united tv community follow red united tv on instagram which is red united tv one baby and follow me personally on ivorian underscore spice same for twitter and remember to follow red united tv on twitch and of course it is what it is make sure you smash that like button share across all social media platforms because we are talking andre onana and our new captain bruno fernandez himself let's get straight into it because guys as you can see breaking news andre onana has officially signed off the releasing a statement saying goodbye to the inter fan on his twitter and instagram account to then a couple of hours later mansion i announcing the transfer I scored they broke it down with a little video which i will be showing you guys right now i'm here to talk about it react to it so make sure you guys enjoy and let's get straight into it because of course we go straight to twitter before we even get to the Manchester united website you can see right here guys today's video of andre onana being released by Manchester united of course for beat show as well tweet it out there as well let me just get straight into it because there is the video i don't want to put it too big so i don't get no copyright strap but there they go right there <laughs> And there you go right there guys andre onana video being shown you like to see that as well and we continue with the news as well we've got andre onana simon stone also confirmed the andre onana to, uh, um to Manchester United confirmed five-year deal plus an option for an extra year incredible honor I've worked hard all my life to get to this moment overcoming many obstacles along the way walking out at Old Trafford defend our goal and contribute to the team will be another amazing experience let's continue with the news more reactions from Andre Nana you can see in the timeline here um to join Manchester United is an incredible honor now worked all my life as i said earlier on to get to this moment as well let's find some more quotes from andre onana he's saying that manchester united have a long history of incredible goalkeepers and i will now give everything to create my own legacy in the coming years walked out of old trafford to, to defend our goal and contribute to the team will be another amazing experience this is the start of our new journey for me and with new teammates and new ambitions to fight for manchester united and you can see it right there he says speaking of eric tanagas andre onana says i am excited by the opportunity to work again with eric ten Hag, and i can't wait to play my part in the success and i know he's determined to deliver at this great football club and yes indeed the football club will you play for is great john Murto comes on to say that andre onana was our top choice to, to become the new goalkeeper for Manchester United with exactly the right profile and technical attributes and also personality. And guys, personality means a lot, especially for Eric Ten Hag. You know, you have to be fit mentally as well to wear the shirt as well. And it's the truth. Let's continue to say Andre Onana. We know that Andre Onana will, will further add to the winning mentality and we are building within our squad. He's already one of the world's best goalkeepers at age 27 we firmly believe that he can develop even further over the coming years and look at it for Richard romano says it's official confirmed andre onana joins Manchester united on a five-year deal valid until june 2028 with an option with a, with a further option you know one year as always as we always do look at him right there i know you guys are loving it andre onana to drain Manchester United is an incredible honor he continues to speak on it as well everyone is tweeting everyone is reacting on andre onana you know what i like that i, I really do like that man and i'll be very honest with you guys this andre onana situation right here i'm looking so forward to it you know i i definitely know that this keeper as well in terms of distribution output and everything 
I know he can do a thing for us. I definitely know that as well. And you guys also know that regarding this Andre Onana. Excellent with the ball at his feet. And I'm so looking forward to it, man. I really am, guys. I don't know what you guys are thinking, but you guys let me know in the comments. Moving on from Andre Onana, we are talking straight about our new captain, Bruno Fernandes, who has officially confirmed captain, brand new captain of Manchester United. And this is coming out from Manchester United website themselves. Look at it there. Manchester United. Fernandes named United's new club captain. And of course, guys, this is after... Harry Maguire himself has been demoted from being captain and, of course, has been told that he may want to seek his future elsewhere. Bruno Fernandes has been named as the new club captain of Manchester United. The Portuguese midfielder has already won the armband for United on numerous occasions and Eric Turner has confirmed that he will now lead the team on a permanent basis. Fernandes has scored 64 goals and contributed 54 assists in just 185 games for the club since joining in 2020. As captain, two-time Sir Matt Bobsey's player of the year will continue to drive the high standard throughout the squad as United push for success in 2023. And of course, our, our manager has had things to say about it. He says that he's, he's developing captains and leaders within the squad. Players like Casemiro, Varane and Martinez are even one of them as well, guys. So let's not, let's remember that we have captains. And I know you guys, some of you guys are thinking, you know what? I don't think Bruno Fernandes was the best choice because he, he moans a lot. But he's been a decent captain. And uh, guys, I want to know what your thoughts on the situation regarding Bruno Fernandes being the new captain as well and your thoughts on Andre Onana signing. Are, are you guys excited? Because I personally think Onana is a good signing for Manchester United, guys. And I think he'll bring so much to our game. And this is the start, the development of our football, you know, the Ten Hag way. And with him coming in there, definitely. With Bruno Fernandes being captain as well, you know what? It's okay. I'm okay with it. Some people are not. Some people rather have Casemiro. Some people rather have Varane or even Maguire. I'm only joking, guys. I'm really only joking. But I'm excited so far for Manchester United. New captain, new goalkeeper, guys. You guys let me know in the comments on your thoughts as well. Make sure you subscribe to Red United TV on YouTube. And also follow Red United TV on Instagram, which is Red United TV 1. Become a member on the YouTube channel as well. We've got many different perks. Follow Ivory underscore Spice, me personally, on Twitter as well. And also remember to follow the Twitch channel. As always, guys, this has been your latest Manchester United news. You let me know in the comments as well um, your thoughts on Andre or Nana. Was it the right goalkeeper? Is it wrong? Oh, we should have kept David De Gea. And of course, Bruno Fernandes. Is he the right captain to take us forward, guys? This has been your latest news. It's your boy, Avril and Spice. And of course, make sure you keep it united. And remember to keep it ready United. Your boy is out. Peace out. Boop, boop.